Hello and welcome to the Slingshot channel. A while ago my wife decided to throw out a very very cheap kitchen knife that we actually got as a present together with a nice piece of ham and so it was just a knife that was supposed to be used just for this one. It's very thin and cheap and uh, my wife just didn't really use it anymore. So she gave it to me and said do with it whatever you want. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say that to the Slingshot channel, because we will turn it into a crossbow. <laughs> so I checked and found that the blade was actually stamped out, of course. Uh, so it had like the same thickness over the entire blade. And um, it was also well hardened, because it was very springy. So I decided to make a crossbow limp out of it. And it worked, and then I had to make a crossbow for it. And I decided to make a very cute, very small, but repeating mini crossbow. <laughs> and here it is, the pocket repeating crossbow. Let me show you its features. <laughs> yeah, so you see it's entirely made from wood. And actually it has a magazine, it's bottom fat. Just because I think it gives me a nicer profile on here. It shoots these very, very small little arrows that have no veins, but are very front heavy. I made them myself from cheap 5mm plastic tubing. And also I used tips for a Dremel tool that I got very inexpensively a long time ago from China. So those are the tips and those are the plastic tubing mini blowguns. <laughs> the magazine actually holds four of these arrows, of these little bolts, and they fly stable because they're front heavy, so they don't really need veins. And to cock it, I just have this little notch here where I can press my thumb in and then you simply use two fingers and cock it like so. And you see now the blade is under a lot of strain. It stores a lot of energy. And it shoots. Bang! <laughs> okay, go for one more. Okay. So again, cocking super easy. Clack and bang. And so forth. Bang. <laughs> now loading is super easy. You simply press on this little lever here, like so. And then you feed in the bolts, like so. And you can also go like Winchester style, clack, until the magazine is full again. Like so. And it feeds nicely in my pocket, like so. Okay. Huh? So, it is a very terrible Derringer crossbow. <laughs> <laughs> so let's test it over some distance. Of course it has no sighting system, so it's guesswork, but let us see if we can hit something with it. Okay. All right. Carefully aim and... Ha! There was a hit. <laughs> okay, let's try again. Ha! Another hit. The string looks very professional, I believe, and this is because I used 2mm Dyneema and spliced it. Therefore, there's no knots, no nothing in here. And I think it's the perfect material for crossbow strings. Now a few words about steel as a spring for crossbows. For these thin, uh, weak crossbows, it's actually okay. Uh, but if you make it thicker and thicker, it is less and less efficient. That is why medieval crossbows really, really had to use a ton of draw force to achieve halfway acceptable energy, um, shot energy. Now you can do the same with a fraction of the draw weight with modern materials like uh, uh, fiberglass and carbon fiber. So uh, modern crossbows are completely different. It's just a superior material for the throwing arm. Therefore, everybody's fascinated by steel, but believe me, steel is usually not a good choice for a crossbow. But on this one, I think it looks rather cute. And since, you know, this used to be a knife blade, I think makes it extra interesting. It's also a very cool recycling project, would you not agree? So is this viable for self-defense? No, no, no. It's a toy. It's a very cool toy. It's a lot of fun. It's a great little project and I enjoy it. 
but it is a toy. <laughs> hey, hey, who says that men aren't allowed to play with toys anymore? Because I do that all the time. Anyway, I hope you like this because that's it for today. Thanks and bye bye. <laughs> okay, one for you, just as always. <laughs> so much fun, it's so easy to use. Bang! Ha 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 ha!